emergency true crews try to revive the man and rush him to the hospital, but unfortunately he didn't make it. And this makes the second drowning at the oceanfront within two weeks. A warm and sunny day at the beach, but the waves weren't so inviting. Just before one o'clock this afternoon, police were called to 34th Street to help a man drowning in the water. He died a short time later after being taken to the hospital. Tonight, beachgoers were still out in the sand. A mother and daughter tells News 3 the waves were strong enough to almost take them under. We were jumping over a wave, and when we went over, it drug us under, and it flipped me, and I hit my head under the, on the ground, and it drug me further out, and it drug her closer to shore. City leaders want to remind everyone that lifeguard patrols ended on resort beaches last Monday. Some believe they should still be around, at least until November. It's still warm and pretty. You know, people still coming out here. I mean, it's been crowded all day today. And kids, I've seen kids in there. And after what happened to us, kids don't need to be in this water. And folks should be aware of rough surf and to not go in the water if conditions are very bad and is recommended to not swim alone and to use the buddy system. 